one local creator in Floyd County is working on an epic fantasy adventure board game under the name Omens of Destiny. Joe Mead is using his experience as a tabletop game player and writer to bring this project to life for others to enjoy. Mountaintop News spoke with me to get a better understanding of his latest entry. Well, it's my first, I guess you would say, board game or project outside of the book genre. So I do have a role-playing game, Mystic Forces, and it's all in book format. Of course, I can do print-on-demand with that, so it's a it's a different world when you go into board games versus what you can release in book form. So it is my second full product, if you will, Mystic Forces. My RPG is the first, but all of those are in book format. This is my first delve into anything outside of just books. So my first board game for sure. Yeah. And definitely a strong role-playing element in it for sure. But this is for the people that by and large are a little more invested, like games that take a little longer on average, three hours for a session of this, um, that do like to be able to advance their characters and, and really work toward the right strategies of you know gear composition as well as the right character composition to be able to work together because you do have to work as a team and if you don't use the right strategies it's, it's real easy to lose hillbilly havoc weekend of destruction demolition derbies are coming to pikeville friday saturday march 29th and 30th at seven each night appalachian wireless arena pikeville it's going to be a crashing good time be there Mead says he is inspired by many works of fantasy as well as other similar board games. For those who wish to support the game's full release, check out the project on kickstarter.com. Robert Jordan's The Wheel of Time series was a huge inspiration. Of course, I've played a lot of role-playing games, played Dungeons and Dragons back in the day and Earth Dawn and, and lots of others, and, and that kind of got me into the whole RPG genre to begin with. Yeah, I, I was heavily influenced by, I would say, Dungeons and Dragons, as well as some fantasy novels, Robert Jordan, R.A. Salvatore, some of those folks. If you want to direct people that to support this, you know, you can go to kickstarter.com and look it up. It's Omens of Destiny. You'll see the Kickstarter, and it'll be uh, actually running until the end of this month. Well, actually, a few days into April. Um, so it's got some time left on it. It'll give you plenty of opportunity to get in there and make a pledge. Multiple reward tiers, most of which do include discounted copies of the game. It'll be cheaper than what it'll be once it hits uh, shelves and retailers. So you can get discounted copies of the game and some extra perks as well. Multiple reward tiers to choose from. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.